and that will creep up just slightly through the parchment paper, just very, very slightly, and it'll just keep your paint a little bit, not moist, but it just frees it really from, it will eventually dry up, paint well, you know, but um, rather than drying in 10 minutes, it might extend it to 20 minutes, you know, which is great. The other little tip I would um, say is, always use a little bit of water this time of year. This is a filbert brush. Okay, now what I would normally do, particularly this time of year, have yourself a little pot of very, very fresh water, dip that in. Obviously you never push your brush into the bottom of any container. You don't want to be doing that. You just damage the bristles. So you push that in like that, get it wet, and then drag it off. So it's just damp, just damp, in, just damp, okay? And that will also extend the life of the paint. You can get retarders and stuff like that. You can get mediums that do prolong um, the extent of the paint, paint how long they're gonna last and how long they stay sort of pliable and manageable for. But you don't really need that. As I say, you know, get some parchment paper, um, some kitchen roll, make your own. Glass palettes, um, I mean, obviously that's going to dry out this time of year, but a glass palette is a great thing to use, you know, especially if you buy, you know, make your own, you know, buy yourself a cheap frame from a jumble sale or whatever, a glass frame, paint the back of it light gray because that'll show up the true colors on the other side and put some tape like duct tape around the edges, all the way around the edges. The cleanup's easy. You can mix well, very, very well, and you can see the true colors. I say the true colors, if you're using acrylics, which I, I use mostly acrylics, they always tend to dry slightly darker. So if you're doing clouds and you're mixing a, a bluey white, it's gonna be more bluey than white once it's dried. Um, so I'm currently working on a larger piece, which you'll see whenever. So we've got one piece done really. Which way up will this go? Should we say this way? So, I don't know what Thursday, what's this, uh, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, is it Thursday the 19th? I don't know. Um, so this one will be up on Thursday anyway, if it is the 19th, then that's the day it's going to be up. And if I get time to finish the big one, today is only Monday. And it's early Monday, it's 10 o'clock-ish, something like that, Monday. So hopefully I'm going to get this one done by Tuesday night or Wednesday. Hopefully the, the big one. Um, I only showed you a very, very quick glimpse because it's going to take a little while. And I'm just about to start it. So um, a wet palette is in order today because it's a very, very warm day. I hope that's helped. It's always good to have a couple of little tips, isn't it, really? You know, so um, anyway, stop chatting, Bri. Okay, then. Um, what I'll do, I'll finish this video now, and then obviously I'll put another video on if I get this one finished. But whatever, I should put some photographs and, and things on. Okay, take care then. Be well and get painting. Hello again. Well, since making the last video, Yeah, since making the last video and then making this little bit, it rains. And I said, didn't I, it hasn't rained for weeks. Can you see me there? Who knows? Um, yeah, it rained last night, which was lovely. So it's cooled things down just a little bit. However, temperature is already raising up today. But we had 27 degrees in here, I think late afternoon yesterday. And today, and the time is 11 o'clock, and we've got 22 degrees, which is much more manageable, isn't it, really, you know? So, don't we talk about the weather, us English? <laughs> right. Um, 
I showed you very, very briefly just a little glimpse of a larger painting and I've completed it. So let's just have a look. There you go. Really happy, really happy. It's turned out great. There's lots, lots of elements in here really. There's some twigs and some branches and there's a couple of bushes. There's even some little birds, um, some petals, some blossom has fallen down onto some rocks. So there's some rocks. Um, there's some small trees, some big trees, some different trees, uh, a few clouds. It goes on and on really. Um, there's also some little spider plants creeping over the rocks slightly. Anyway, that's enough, isn't it? So there's a lot, really. So yeah, kind of cherry blossom, sort of. Okay. It's a good look at that, isn't it? So I will put um, some photos on in a minute. Yeah, all done and dusted, that one. That's, um, the size is 12 by 10, just in case you wonder. And that will be on sale on eBay on the I'm, uh, 19th. Do you know what? I'm gonna tell you properly, because I don't know even what the day is today. 17th today. Tuesday so we've got the 19th on Thursday so 7 p.m. roughly is when my art comes up as you know on eBay right it's gonna be a hot day so wherever you are get in the shade chill out drink loads and uh, enjoy your day thanks for watching take care and be well mm -hmm.